What's up guys? Pete here from the Sunday Drive. Today we're going to show you how to properly breed breed. Today we're going to show you how to properly bleed your brake calipers if you have a 4 or 6 piston or more piston uh, brake caliper. So today we're going to be showing you on our 2017 Corvette C7 and basically if you've ever seen calipers with bleeder screws on the inside and outside of the calipers, the proper way to bleed them is to first bleed the inside screw and then the outside screw. So in our case, we already have the system pressurized using a Motive Products power bleeder. So the whole system has up to 15 PSI in here. So once you crack the inside bleeder screw, the fluid will be pushed out and then you can close that off and then you can open up the outside bleeder screw. First caliper that you want to bleed is going to be furthest away from the ABS module. So in our case, it's the rear passenger caliper. Also, quick reference, in the case of our brake calipers, it requires an 11 millimeter socket or wrench. It'd be different for everybody, I'm sure. But that's it. If you found this video to be helpful, please give us a big like and subscribe, and thanks for watching.